Hello everyone, this is war number three. Now, <clears throat> this is a very short war. I scouted my path and I saw a magic, which seemed to be rank 4 or rank 5 after. So I brought hood to avoid the limbo damage. Now this is a very short war. We were one member short and we had no backup. So uh, we decided that we should that I should wait till the last moment just in case somebody needed help, but uh, Nobody did so I just took my normal path Now this is a very 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 easy fight. This is just a diversity probably and Storm is very straightforward to fight with ghost She goes down Absolutely no problem. I don't even get a blocked hit so I am a still a hundred percent health. Next one, I think this is a Captain America Infinity War, if I remember correctly. Let me see. Oh, was a wasp. I think I do get evaded at some point here. I'm not. I'm, I'm not sure. But what I usually do with against wasp is do one hit, um, just to avoid. And then facing before hitting her again to avoid getting uh, evaded and uh, shocked since uh, critical hits from ghost can't be evaded. So, pretty straightforward as well. Why do I think there is a Captain America Infinity War here? I mean, somewhere on this path. Maybe I am remembering something else. It's a Modok. Now, I do hate fighting Modok with ghost in. Um, a masochism node because my strategy against Modok is just to parry him like I would any other champ and just launching the heavies which I mean is not too bad with ghosts you still get the the cruelties and the furies so it's not too bad ah uh, now I, I do notice please that I don't evade or face that sp1 because modox sp1 can actually reverse some of uh, your power gain and or your regen I believe so if uh, I have phased through that he would still have reversed my power so what I need now is just some furies to be able to take him down and he goes down that's it no no problem there really um now for the magic fight, which is actually, if I do remember correctly, the last fight. This was very short. Since I was uh, the last one, everything else had already been taken down. So my participation was very, very little here during this war. Now, as for magic, it is a tricky fight. You have to time your facing to match her limbo. And it's not always that easy to do. Um, uh, I do take quite a lot of damage. I decided not to heal up. Um, I thought it would be enough. I should have healed up. If I had been hit or something, <coughs> sorry, at some point, uh, I would have died. Most definitely. I don't think I got hit at any point. But her limbo does eat through my health like it's candy and it's not fun um so she starts going down but her limbo is annoying she must not be very high sig her limbo did not uh, proc all that often but all I'm doing now is a race against time to launch my sp2 and she goes down before her limbo has time to end and heal her back up now I'll be, uh, the next thing you will see is me just going straight to the boss somebody else took it so I did not have the opportunity to take that domino down also I wasn't feeling like healing up so thanks I had spent uh, I have spent a lot of items lately in map 6 and the previous wars and I don't I didn't want to spend any more Potions. I would have if needed, but I was thankful I didn't have to. Now, this is it for me in this war, so I hope you enjoyed the video, and I will see you in the next one.